Welcome to the homepage of the Lead2 Knowledge Base. On the homepage, you can find the navigation menu, the slider, news and events, and recent publications. To continuously navigate through the website, you need to create a free account. There are two ways to create a free account. First, via the slider, and second, via the navigation menu. On the registration page, fill in the required information such as your username, a valid email address, secure password, first name, gender, and country of origin. You're also required to answer some questions before you submit your form. When everything is filled in, click Submit. You will then receive a notification of your registration on your email. Now, you have created your account and you're also automatically logged in. To access the lead to projects deliverable, such as the workshop material, training course material, videos, and publications, go to the navigation menu and choose the online referencing tool. On this page, you can find the category list on your right-hand side, and in the middle, the search button, and the list of publications that are recently uploaded to the system. To search for an article, type the keyword of your search, for example, a title or a name of an author. The publications are also assigned by categories. This could be an easy way to narrow down your search. The Lead2 Knowledge Base website is also a medium for Lead2 community members to interact. The community can be accessed through the navigation menu. On this page, you can find the questions or even start a discussion. To start a discussion, click here. Then, add topic. Type a title of your topic such as a question or a headline. In the space provided, type your questions, embed a link, or insert media. Then, add topic. To respond to existing topics or questions, click the question, then type your response. Finalize it by clicking Add Reply. Part of the Lead2 community called Padlet can also be accessed through the navigation menu. I hope that with this short tutorial, you will not find it difficult to navigate through the website.